How much do you know about the town or village you live in? Warsaw Local History Centre organise a variety of guided tours explaining the history of many places we visit every day but know so little about. I joined a walk in a place known as the Kingdom of Mercia. The Mercian families, Anglo-Saxons, they came in uh, and they established lots of little communities all over the place. And goes back to the time of the Doomsday Book, it's an Anglo-Saxon village. Mm -hmm. There's still a lot of Victorian buildings here. Mm -hmm. There's uh, you've probably got the oldest monument in the borough, in the churchyard, the old preaching cross, which they reckon dates back to the 13th century. And if you still haven't guessed it by now, it's Bloswick. Known today as Bloxwich, the little town north of Warsaw is steeped in history and with its own identity, as local historian Stuart Williams explains. Well, I think they'll probably find that one or two things will confirm what they thought they knew about Bloxwich, but in a way which will be surprising to them. Fifteen of us walked the two-hour tour of Bloxwich, starting at the Preaching Cross, walking along the High Street through the Promenade Gardens, and finishing the Pat Collins's clock. You'll be able to see that that is the Grosvenor Cinema. Now it's used as the Electric Palace. After the end of uh, World War I, the Electric Palace, the predecessor of this, was bought out by fairground mogul Pat Collins. Pat Collins, King of Showman, was a prominent politician and councillor who became Mayor of Warsaw in 1938, with many parts of the town dedicated to him. Why have you come on the walk today? Um, I'm interested in local history, the whole of the borough actually, but uh, that's very specifically because it was part of my upbringing and childhood at Bloxwich. I'm a town councillor now, mm -hmm. and this, my ward is just over there, and obviously it pinches a lot on the greater Bloxwich area. Um, I've always enjoyed walking, and Sanas as well, and I thought, that might be alright, I'm going to have a look at it. Might be because we're getting older now, or down now, wouldn't it? It just goes to show that some of the best things are right under your nose.